Hi guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel. My name is Sarah Wisted. Today's video, I'm sharing some fall shopping that I've done lately. Per usual, this is somebody who leans more minimalistic. I wear a lot of neutrals, textures, and a main focus of what I tend to bring in my closet is our pieces that can be styled in many different ways. I essentially wanna bring in pieces that I can wear for the long term and items that are really easily styled with the rest of my closet. I feel like that just has made it so much easier for me to get dressed in the mornings, kind of like a capsule wardrobe, if you will, but some of them are a little bit trendy for this season so I will dive into them shortly the first brand I am going to share is a sweater brand that I have been wanting to try out and it's called 525 America this video is sponsored by 525 America and if you haven't heard of them they are a brand that focuses on quality cotton sweaters and modern shapes textures and colors so pretty much in line with what I bring into my closet already their goal is to deliver premium quality and a timeless design at an accessible price point most of their sweaters are 100% cotton but they do have some beautiful cashmere options that I'm actually going to show you. Cashmere is one of my favorite sweater styles and I'm also a sweater lover so let's just jump right in. Okay so this is the first sweater and it's a classic like I said. It's called their Emma and this is the 100% organic cotton sweater. This one is actually the best seller on their site and for good reason because it is very classic shape. We all know that a crew neck sweater like this, just plain black, can pretty much go with endless outfits, especially for fall when layering starts to become a thing. I kind of like the oversized, kind of more relaxed look lately. So I have this one untucked, of course, with a pair of straight leg jeans and some square toe boots. But you could also tuck the shirt in. If you like your sweater tucked, you can do it this way. Flowy pants, a skirt, a close up, but this is, like I said, their 100% cotton option. I'm about to try on one of their cashmere options, but this one is super soft. It has like that ribbed detail that we love to see in a sweater. And yeah, it's a classic shape. Okay, so this one is their Emma sweater, but in 100% cashmere. Cashmere is just one of my most favorite fabrics to choose in a sweater. Not only just for the comfort, because it's super warm and cozy, but it also just looks so much more elevated in my opinion. I love that you have the option to do 100% cotton or cashmere and like I said earlier it is at a very approachable price point so it is nothing that's gonna really break the bank it's just a classic sweater at a good price point and you know you're getting good quality just because the fabrics they use are or the threads that they use are high quality as well and then this is what I mean by like a casual work from home situation I do work from home so I'm always on the hunt for items that I can wear working from home that also don't make me feel like lazy if that makes sense for me I can speak for myself that anytime I put an outfit on in the morning and I'm not just wearing what I would wear to bed or to work out for example it makes me feel like the day is a little bit more special, so I do try and get like semi-dressed up. This is their Ellie Cashmere Crew Neck Sweater, and it's just another simple crew neck sweater from 525 America. This is the 100% Luxe Cashmere blend that they offer, and it is very soft and just extremely versatile because when you have a sweater that's not so oversized, not so chunky, you can tuck them into your pants if you would like to, but I like the detail on this one specifically with the larger ribs on the side and then just like the more classic shape up here. So I feel like this one's going to be able to go with a lot of layering options. I do have a promo code for 525 America for you guys, of course. So if you are looking for a classic long-term super cozy sweater to add to your wardrobe for the multiple outfits for the fall, then you can use my promo code which is just Sarah30 for 30% off. It is valid until October 31st, so if you're going to do a little shopping, then definitely do it in the month of October and let me know what you guys pick up. All right, let's get into the rest of the haul. So dish is next. I do like to try and group my brands together, so that's kind of why I'm going in this order. But I just received this order a few days ago from Dish, and I was so excited to get it and try it on. You guys know I'm a Dish lover. I feel like they have a really good selection of minimal but elevated clothes on their website. And all of their, from what I have received, all of the pieces are very good quality. And the first thing I grabbed from them was this oversized, like a jacket type thing. It's like a shirt 
shorter, but it's a little bit thicker. So I think they call it a jacket on their website. And they do have it in a few colors. I did pick up the black just because I don't I don't feel like I have something like this in my wardrobe. Talk about wear it in multiple situations. I had it planned with this outfit specifically, which is also paired with their skirt, which I think is so cute. I also feel like this little jacket situation would be so cute with even just leggings or sorry, it looked like something just fell from my roof. Anyway. But yeah, I feel like this is super versatile. You can wear it with leggings, you can wear it with a skirt, you can wear it with a dress underneath, would be so cute. So yeah, this is one of those, I feel like long-term, super cute options for fall. And then of course this skirt, I think it's really cute, especially with like an oversized sweater. Speaking of sweaters, I wanted to show you guys this skirt with the oversized sweater. I just feel like it's super cute and casual. And the sweater, the way it drapes and the way it hangs from your body is chef's kiss, in my opinion. Um, I just like love how oversized and draped this is. I gotta figure out what size this is. Okay, so this is a size small. I'm in between a small and extra small. I don't even know if this goes down to an extra small, but if you're in between sizes, I would go with the larger size because I love how oversized this looks. I think it's so perfect. All right, so these pants are the next item that I picked up, and they are a little bit long. I haven't gotten them altered yet. These are from Dish as well, and they are linen. So I know going into fall, I don't tend to gravitate towards linen, but I saw these on their site, and I was like, these are so dramatic. I feel like they're just a little bit more oversized and more flowy than like a wool trouser, for example. I did pick up another black pair of wool trousers, which I'll show you from Cost just because I wanted to have the option of something like this and more like casual, more flowy. The great news about these, of course, is you can wear them in like spring and summer as well. Another core Sarah Wisted brand is Shona Joy. Yes, I'm getting myself core brands. The way that their clothing fits on a woman's body is like, couldn't be more perfect. This is one of their Laloon dresses. I love the little slip that they have here and the back's low as well, which I just think is so stunning. All right, I wanted to show you guys this Shona Joy dress as well. I actually ordered this one off Poshmark. It's this beautiful like sage green, almost grayish color. And it's just really well made and I feel like it's a very long-term classic piece that's a little bit sexy, but not too revealing. All right. Up next is another core brand, if you will, and this is for Koss. You guys obviously know I wear Koss all the time. I feel like they have a really good selection of basics that are not basic. These pants were really the motivation, if you will, to shop on Koss. They, I don't know if you can tell on screen, but they are this really deep chocolate brown. They're almost black, but they are brown, I can assure you that. And I really loved the balloon shape of them. I feel like this is a really in, this is a really like trendy thing that's happening this fall that I personally am really loving. I don't usually shop a ton of trends, but this didn't seem like too crazy. I really love the baggy oversized look. So I'm into this wide leg oversized baggy type pants. They're like a um, cotton material, so they're not denim. This top is also from Cost, and the reason that I picked this one up is because I love a layering moment. I love to layer a lot of my outfits in the fall and this is like a perfect base for like a layered situation but I also love that it's sheer and see-through. I usually have a really beautiful bralette that I have that I put underneath sheer tops like this that I could not find but I do wear something like this sometimes as well but I just really think that a top like this goes with a lot like if you want to have something a little more interesting on the bottom having a more basic but not basic top on top makes it a little bit easier another sweater but could you guess <laughs> and then these are the other pants that I was talking about from cost the pleated front that are similar to the dish pants but a different material and I feel like these are very classic and goes with literally everything I mean if you don't have a pair of pants like this definitely would add something like this to your closet and cost is a great option for that and then regarding the sweater I was on the hunt for a gray classic looking sweater but I really was looking at texture so I love the texture of this one I feel like it just adds a little something. You guys know I tend to dress a lot of monochrome, a lot of minimalistic style outfits, and the way to keep those type of outfits more interesting is to add 
an unexpected texture or just something that an unexpected texture or shape I would say is kind of the way I make an outfit more interesting and this one has kind of an unexpected texture it's like a little bit longer of a hair than you would see on a sweater and I just think it's so beautiful it's extremely cozy this one's really soft she's in color you guys this dress Honestly, might have spurred this entire shopping haul because I saw this. This is off of Naked Fashion. I do shop there sometimes because I feel like they also have classic long-term pieces. But the one thing I want to say really quickly about Naked is out of everything I've purchased on their site, I feel like their dresses are the best quality. I haven't really had luck with really any of their other categories. This one I feel like is classic but also trendy and I saw it on their site. It's the Naked Laura J. Stone collection. And I was like, oh, it's gonna sell out if I don't buy it. So I like impulse purchased it. But I am so glad I did. This has holiday written all over it. It is this deep red. So it's not like an in your face red, it's almost like a maroon color. And it's just it's so striking. I love the shape of the balloon sleeve. This part is a little bit tighter, so you can like. Let me show you what it looks like now. So this is what it like looks like, but it's tighter right here, so you can kind of like ruche it up a little bit. And it's the perfect shape, in my opinion, for a sweater dress. Like this is the perfect shape. I don't really know what else to tell you. The other thing I love is that how draped it looks. I just feel like they got the draping like perfect on this dress and it's really thick. I'm literally obsessed with this dress. I think I'm gonna wear this for my holiday photo shoot for, we do a family photo shoot every year for Christmas cards. I honestly think I might wear this Christmas Eve. Okay, so this is the next dress from Naked and I actually kept the tag on this one. You can't see obviously, but I can't decide. So I need your help on whether I should keep this or not. And the one thing that's holding me back about this, because I actually do love everything about it. I love how classic it is. I love the color of it. I love the ribbed detail. Like it's like a thicker ribbed and it's actually pretty lightweight. So I feel like I could wear it and not get overheated versus that like red sweater dress that I just showed you. But the one holdback is, is it's so extremely long on me. Like, it's like trip yourself long. Based on my experience, getting a dress like this altered, the hem never looks the same and it just kind of like ruins the dress. So, I don't know, I've just not had good experiences getting knit dresses altered. So I'm just trying to decide what I should do with that. The look of it's really nice and it's really lightweight and I liked the ribbed details. It's very stretchy, very, very, very comfortable. But it's just so freaking long. All right, on to Cezanne, which is also, I feel like, a core brand for me. This coat, or it's a jacket, I guess, it's not a coat, but it's really just like a knit, a heavier knit cardigan. I, I've already worn this before. It's really, really comfortable, and I feel like it goes with so much. It just adds a little bit of an interesting detail to an otherwise boring outfit, which I feel like Cezanne is pretty much known for. But yeah, I really liked the shape and the quality of this. This one also does come in a few other colors. I think maybe just one other. Ah, you guys know I love Cezanne. And their knitwear is my favorite. Pretty much all my sweaters are from Cezanne or Cos. This one is a knit bomber jacket, which I think is so cool. You guys know I love sweaters. I feel like a bomber shape is a really cool shape for fall. So yeah, this knit bomber is really when I saw it on their site, I was like, yep, add that one to cart. It's a color that I wear a lot of. So being able to throw it on with a lot of my outfits just made a lot of sense. And it's very cozy. It's like a warm, I don't know what you would call this material. It's just very, very warm. Like our usual cozy, cozy Cezanne sweaters. So this one, I want your opinion on. I really love the shape of it and I love a good denim like oversized shirt or like coat type of thing. This is considered a jacket but it is just like a denim oversized shirt essentially and I think the shape of it's really cool. I love this pocket like I feel like this was a really good design but it showed up a little more blue than I thought it was going to be and you guys know colors I'm just kind of venturing into my world of colors and I don't know I haven't really found a moment that I felt that I was drawn to this. 
So I gotta figure this out because I do really like the shape of it and I think it's a really cool look. But the color is just freaking me out just a little bit. Okay, last but certainly not least is this super cute jacket coat from Canada Goose. This was one of the bigger valued items that I've brought into my closet for fall and I am, you guys, fully obsessed with this coat and I can't wait for a moment to wear this. So cozy, but it's not overly warm. So if you're somebody who lives in Atlanta or somewhere that doesn't get super cold, I feel like this is a great statement coat that's also extremely versatile. So this one does come with a hood. So if it's raining or snowing, <laughs> you could put the hood up. But you also can remove the hood completely. So if you're somebody who doesn't want the hood and you just really want just like this really beautiful collar to be seen, um, you can remove the, the hood completely. There's a, I don't know, you call this like pull bungee thing in the intro, like in the middle, pull bungee thing that you can tighten here to make this a little bit, like change the shape of the coat to make it go in at your waist a little bit more, which I think is so flattering, especially in coats that are a little bit more oversized to be able to like cinch your waist a little bit is like, Perfect, we'd love to see it. It does come in black as well, but this almost army green type color I thought was just so stunning. Hey guys, that was it for my fall shopping haul. I hope you enjoyed it and I hope it was helpful in any way. Don't forget my promo code for 525America, which is just Sarah30 for 30% off until October 31st. I will put all that information in the description box below. I will attempt to link everything that I shared with you unless it's sold out, which is you know such a bummer, but I will do my best. Don't forget to give this video a thumbs up and consider subscribing to my YouTube channel and that's about it so I will talk to you guys on my next video.